Hey everyone, it's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone is doing well. I hope everyone is able to relax on this Sunday. Um, while you're watching this, I will be actually um, on the pool deck officiating for the second day of our meet. But anywho, we have part two of my Craftably pre-order unboxing. I originally was going to group the last three kits into um, one video, but each kit is from a different artist. So I wanted to give each kit its own attention. So anyway, here it is. Here is my second kit. This is from a new artist to me. I have never gotten a kit from this artist, but I absolutely loved it. This is Sunny's Flowers. Sorry, Sunny's Flowers by Kara Ann Aldridge. And it is a 16 inch by 22 inch round kit. Um, I absolutely loved it. Um, you know, I love sunflowers. I loved the color palette. I loved the sparkle. And I just, it was really interesting. I just really, really wanted it. I thought it was super pretty. So I'm not going to focus too much on the box. Um, if you missed my first unboxing from Craftably, I will go ahead and throw that up in the eye and I'm apologizing if you're hearing any licking because Levi is drinking some water. So let us get into it. Everyone is doing well. I know I already said that, but saying it again. I hope that everybody has been receiving their pre-orders. I still actually have like four more from another pre-order, I believe. But I am definitely excited and enjoying these. And of course I bumped you again. I love the box. I absolutely love the box. And let's look at Amy. Let's look at Amy. Hi, Amy. All right. Um, I'm going to, oh my God, there's some tabs I'm over here. All right, so let me try and get into this without damaging the box. All right, so we have, first we have our toolkit. I'm not gonna really go into it, to the toolkit too much, because you guys, um, if you've been around, you are seeing Craftably, you've already seen this. We're just gonna check out the extra goodies. And I went over it in my last video, so you can check that out there. So this is a much smaller kit than I um, have gotten before, so I'm really happy about that. But let's check out our toolkit. Again, the awesome soft burlap bag. They come in so handy for other things as well. Got our toolkit. And let's see what extra goodies we got. Oh, come on now. Our pot of wax. So we've got some fuchsia or kind of reddish ones. They almost look like dolphin or, or not dolphin mermaid scales. And then this purple and white and gray striped washi. You get so much of it. This washi is such great quality. And then we have a little mosaic heart minder, super cute. Stick all this back in here. Upgraded toolkit. When I mean upgraded toolkit, I mean because they now have purple trays and purple wax and all that. All right, ooh, and that opened up nicely. So it comes in a dust bag, which I really, really love. And I just threw this on the floor, my goodness. All right, let's put that down. Now be very, very careful as there is a piece of tape, but it's not gonna do anything. It doesn't harm your canvas. It doesn't really pull up hardly any lint. People say it tears up the back of the canvas. It doesn't. At all get rid of that now um craftably's canvases they are scalped and poked brim fraying and they are like a soft lint back canvas so super super soft all right let's get our large goodies out what oh god this is such a nice image nice 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 all right so we have our drills pre-packed drills right here 
with a bigger thumbnail on there. And since, you know, I saw other people's videos and that I was opening up my drills wrong. So they're right from here. So I won't be ripping up my sticker like I did the last time. So let us check out our nice big sticker um, legend right here. These are all pre-cut labels. So you get some fun stickers and here it says, you know, the name of the painting, peelable stickers. Um, and then you get extra stickers right here. And there's your thumbnail sticker right there and you can put your start and end date. This has 53 colors, you guys, 53 colors. And it has one, two, two ABs and four crystals. So that is really, really exciting. Um, people have said that these labels are somewhat kind of big and that they don't really fit on their containers. Um, I use my pre-bagged drills, so I'm just gonna plop the labels right on the baggies to make it easier, and then use all these fun stickers in my log book. Plus, you get all these extra stickers, so you can save those as well. And you can use them if you need them for extra colors. So we'll take a look at the drills uh, later, but let us take a look at our kit. Oh, wait. I forgot they now including this little pamphlet right here. Well, though, with customer service, sharing your progress on their social medias and how to diamond paint and fun accessories. Now, um, you, if you don't have a tube and you want one, you can still get a tube. They're about $15, I believe, and you can purchase it on their website. So are you guys ready for the reveal? Here we go. Oh my goodness, look at her. Yes, Miss Ma'am. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, so we have craftably up at the top, diamond painting. And then we have, excuse me. I'm so sorry, you guys. Uh, we have two big legends up on the sides of our kit, one in your upper left. One in your lower right, which includes your thumbnail right here and does give the size of the paint in the 18 by 22. Now, I'm going to roll this back a little bit. Now, remember, Craftably does their sizings in um, inches. So, I know a lot of us are used to centimeters, but they do theirs in inches, which is very, very helpful because this is going to be so easy to frame. 18 by 24s are such common size. They all pretty much are, but I really appreciate it for that. It makes it a lot easier to find a frame. I am so excited about this. So I'm absolutely loving her hair. There's actually quite a bit of confetti in her hair. I'm very interested to see about um, the, the um, her skin tone and how it's blending, but I think it's going to be very, very pretty because to me, just by looking at the rendering, it looks like the sun is shining on her face. I'm loving the huge sunflowers. Um, even the one in the upper, far upper corner right here is kind of like a focal point to me because it draws your eye up to the corner. We have another sunflower behind her. And of course that really, really big one up there. And you guys know how much I love sunflowers. So I love her face. She's absolutely beautiful. So I'll bring you up. The symbol clarity is amazing, but I will bring you guys up. Just I'll bring it up to you so you can see. And there is quite a bit of confetti in here, but it's going to be so worth it and beautiful. There are opportunities to use a multi-placer, maybe like a four, but it's still really, really, really pretty. There's a little bit of line. I mean, it's confetti, but I guess you could, you could, you still use a multi-placer through her hair, probably just like a two or a three though. So I don't know if it's, I mean, I would still do it, but oh my. So let's check out the sticky. Craftably uses a really thick plastic. I like that because it protects it. The only thing I don't like is it's really, really hard to cut for me to cut through. It's kind of like the same thickness that's on a Treasure Studios art kit. So it's very, 
very, very difficult for me at times, for me. All right, let's check the sticky out. Okay, that is sticky. If you can lift the painting up when, with one finger, it is sticky. So let me just gradually roll this back. I know that Craftably has been working so, so hard to get everybody's pre-orders out to them and with all the shipping delays and other items that they've had to deal with this year with all these pre-orders. So I'm glad that they have been able to get through that and hopefully they will have some time to rest a little bit and catch up. I wanted to show you at the bottom, there is also a thumbnail with the name of the painting and the artist showing that it is uh, legally licensed, so the artists are compensated if that is what is important to you. Here's also your um, sharing the progress with their socials and their guarantee. So if for any reason you have an issue with your canvas or you simply don't like them, please reach out to Craftably and let them, you know, try to make it right. All right, so let us take a look at our drills. I am not going to turn the painting over um, because I, I don't see a point. Now, Craftably drills all, of course, I'm still ripping this. Good grief. Um, Craftably puts their drills in orders, in order, and then they put tend to put all their ABs and their crystals at the bottom, which I definitely appreciate. So let's make sure I have it. So we have one, a yellow AB right here, AB 307. Then we have a darker AB 742, which you're probably used to seeing. Then we have a little red crystal right here. And then we have, um, oh, a yellow crystal. And then I think this is like a slightly lighter yellow crystal. And then we have a clear crystal, which is supposed like basically like a 5200, right? So I think that that's probably going to go where all these sparkles are. But we're going to put those aside. I'm going to close this up real quick so we can check these out and where they go. So let's see. The first one, AB307, right here, that is the number six. So hopefully I can find where that will go. I'm just gonna shoot to the top. No, I'm not. I'm trying to see, I am having issues of where it's going to put this right over here as I keep bumping you guys. Let's see. It's in the sunflower. No, you guys, it's not in the sunflower at all that I am seeing. Am I sure? Am I reading that right? Is that a six? It is a six. Oh, here we go. So it's going to be over here, I believe, is that a six? No. Yeah, so anyway, it's sprinkled over here, and it's sprinkled over here on the sides. So AB742, that's the letter E. And that is everywhere. That is just literally wherever you see this kind of darker, where my, where my finger is, sorry, right there. That is where the six goes. So that is also throughout the sunflowers as well. Then we have uh, the red crystal, which is the letter L. Now there isn't very much of it. And I'm sorry, I just keep bumping you like, So I think that's going to be going in the middle of the the middle of the sunflowers right here. You know, where all this confetti is, there's going to be sprinkles of red right there. Uh 744 or or 444, the P 
that wherever you see the yellows in the sunflowers and the, or in her choker, that's where all of that is going to be. The same with 745, which is the um, up carrot like that, kind of like the up sign. Let me see. Yeah, that's going to be in her medallion on her choker right there. And then last but not least, we have the 5200, and that is the O circle, like, like a circle, a white circle with the black outline. So that is not like I thought being in her hair. What is that? Three. Symbol three. There are a lot of symbols right here. That's 739. All right, so that's not even white like I thought it was going to be. But anyway, back to these O's. So there's going to be a, like two, a couple in her eyes. There are some up here in the top of her hair. So there is some, so that's nice. And a couple in the sunflowers up at the top. So that is where all of our specials are. So if you're new and unfamiliar and you're like, why, why is this happening? And I thought that these were just regular kits. That's the one thing that, in my opinion, that makes Craftably stand out from a lot of other diamond painting companies is that they include so many other special drills, just standard in like, like kind of like a mixed media type package where you get your regular drills, and then you get your crystals as well as your AVs. The only other company that I know of that switches it up like that is uh, Crafties. So um, it's very nice. So let's take a really quick look at these colors because um, I'm not going to pull them all out and mess them up. So we've got this beautiful, like more like maybe a periwinkle or cornflower. There's greens and browns and oranges. There are some darker colors like some 310 and um, some grays. There's some burgundy and brown in here. Some more of the yellow. Very, very, very nice. Pre-bag drills. Makes it easy for kitting up though, if you don't like working out of baggies. Topes. So I just think it's a really, fun and pretty color palette. Again, I'm loving the sky because it looks like it's like a kind of maybe overcast. You've got some different shades of blue and maybe like wisps of white that are, are lighter blue to make it kind of look like clouds. Um, actually, I am going to look in here real quick because I just want to check out her skin color. I'm going to rip this bag. So, There's so many in here though. Ugh. So I'm just gonna like kinda. That's more, I'm just hoping she's not really red. Three, three, seven, one. What is that? Three, three, seven, one. Did I even read that right? Yeah, three, three, seven. Oh, it's up here, Marina. Okay, what symbol is that? I can't even see. Oh, that's like part of a parenthesis. So that's just like some shading on her face right there. Um, we have this 3857. What is that? 3857. That is in there as well. That looks kind of red, but I think with like all the other variants and other colors in there, like color combinations. Oh, that's 902, that's more like a wine. I just hope she doesn't come out red. Um, I'm loving the fact that there's so much inclusivity and more uh, people of color in diamond art um, and that they are depicted in the modern day, modern age, stunning, um, woman. Not that I don't appreciate the other style of art, but let's be reasonable. Not everything is, um, scars and headdresses and things of that nature. It's still beautiful, but 
come on, it's 2022. This is what we need to be seeing. We need to be seeing more of this. Um, she's beautiful. Um, and hopefully, I, I'm the pro probably not going to be able to squeeze her in because um, I have to finish projects. Maybe I will. Um, and I had a straight, oh, I had a little straight drill fall out. That needs to go back in there. Excuse me for that. Don't let me forget. I'm going to do it right now. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm excited. I am having, where did it go now? Oh my God, where the heck? Did I just flick it? I didn't even do anything. And it just like, it ran, it literally just ran away. Did you guys? Good grief. I just opened that for nothing. Anyway, I have been enjoying everybody's, um, everybody's unboxings that I've been seeing and posts about everybody, uh, their pre-orders. So keep them coming, you guys. So I hope you enjoyed part two of my Craftably pre-order. This is my second kit out of four. Um, and like I said earlier in the eye, I posted that video off in the eye from my first one. All right, you guys, so let's recap real quick. We have this really beautiful image by Kara Ann um, Aldridge. It is called um, Sunny's Flowers. Uh, it is an 18 by 22 inch round diamond painting with 53 colors with two ABs and four crystals. All right, you guys, I'm going to let you go. Um, like I said, I hope you'd enjoy this. And I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day and your weekend. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.